Hey guys, I'm out here today at this old case 230. Got a request for a video showing how to uh, hook up the, or how to run the twine. Okay, this is the twine box. It'll hold one, two, three, four. Move this out of the way. Four, four bales of twine. Your twine will come up, the one on the far side will go through the top right here, go through this piece. The one on this side will go through this piece here at the edge, and they'll both go down, one each, one in each hole, through this twine tensioner, which is adjustable, it's just spring-loaded, and it keeps tension on the twine. From there, it's going to go through this uh, porcelain holder down here, through the bottom. It's going to run over to this porcelain holder right here. This one does. Both both sets of twine run through this, and then it'll split. And when it splits, one will go to one needle and one will go to the other. It's a little bit damp this morning, but anyway, at front of each needle is another holder. There's one over yonder. It'll go up through the bottom of the holder. It'll go through the needle just like that. And then you'll tie it off right here. Just, just make you a good square knot and tie it to there. And then when the knot is tripped, it'll come up and your twine holder will catch you, will catch the end of it, and the other, the other end will be cut, so that it'll just be dangling from there. And that's all you got to do. Uh, you do want to make sure there's no sharp edges that the twine's rubbing on. And after a while, you'll see, you'll probably be able to see the wire marks with the twine rubbing on the, that twine goes under that brace here and goes across and goes up. You don't want the twine to go above the brace because then it's going to get in the way of the needles. So it goes under the brace and then up. So hope this helps and the last time I used this baler, I broke my drive shaft. Cracked it pretty good. I ain't got around to welding it up yet, but both sides got a good crack in it. I don't know if I'll fool with this year or wait till next year, but either way, hope this helps you out. Uh, yeah, the only way I can see you was messing up on on threading it would be if you was going above that piece there and then if you did that it could get in the way of the needles when the needles come up it would catch your twine and kind of mess it up a little bit so anyway thanks for watching